The discourse for the lecture was all about mathematical algorithms and equations. The event was held at the multipurpose hall of the university with an opening procession by the university community. Professor Gregory Wajiga, who is a professional in computer science with the university, is the keynote speaker. High computing involves precise and static models and based on bionic logic, grid systems and software. Programs are deleted in high computing. Uh, it requires exact input data and strictly expression. Also, it must end in exact and precise answers. Why is it computing? It's the opposite. It, it has intolerance for imprecision and secondly, partial truth. The lecture is concerned with finding a method to solve a large problems using algorithmic methods by bringing out the best solution. The professor emphasized on the importance of the topic as it is a new area seeking to construct systems that are computationally intelligent, possesses human expertise and be able to explain decisions. For a hundred cities, there are n factorial possible solutions. n factorial, if n is a hundred, that is hundred times ninety-nine times ninety-eight and you get one. Get the value of that. That is the number of solutions that are possible for a hundred cities. But you can also apply such things such as dynamic programming, which is also in the order of n squared. The Vice Chancellor of the University, Professor Kiari Mohammed, presented an award on behalf of the University to the Professor for his mind blowing presentation. The different algorithms that people study are varied based on the problems they want to solve. Understanding them will go in handy to choosing which to use depending on the kind of problem intended to solve. Zainab Bala, Gotel News.